Although summer season is a time when many couples get married and flowers are a big part of their big day, buying local matters more than you might think. Here to talk more about that is Kathleen Yoshinaga, director of the Hawaii Floriculture and Nursery Association. Good morning. Thank you for Good being morning. here. Thank talk you. Talk more about what the association is and what it does. Our goal is to promote, uh, to promote the to the community, uh, promotion of of our uh, of our nurserymen's to grow and to sustain, and actually we promote um, our flowers by growing and to export it, to help export it. Okay, That's and there are videos that are produced statewide. Um, people might have seen it. What's the mission behind these videos? What's the goal? The goal is to educate the community about what how we can use our flowers and also to uh, to use our flowers and to promote the uh, consumer on how you could do it what you can do with them and also um, plants that how to pr and we also want to reduce the import of um, floriculture pests that could invasive uh, invasive pests mm -hmm. that could upset the balance of our ecosystem and are also promoting it by the local matters campaign started by the Hawaii Department of Agriculture and this campaign will help the local consumers contribute to Hawaii's sustainability um, and strengthen the economy by creating jobs and also reduce the chance of importing invasive species that might accidentally be carried in by imported flowers and plants. Okay, let's talk about some of the arrangements you brought over. This is something kind of familiar that we might see not just at, at a wedding, mm -hmm. but any kind of um, Could event. be a party, right. could be a graduation party, could mm -hmm. be a birthday party. It's something you could use for the head table here. This mm -hmm. is in front of the main head table or even a church altar. Okay. This something like this is just something nice you could use for a wedding, maybe mm -hmm. a centerpiece for a guest table. Right. And I brought in a little nosegay bouquet that you might want that, that you could use cute. for a little wedding. It's a tropical yeah. but it brings in the colors of your orange and reds mm -hmm. and very local, very right. tropical. I use raffia, tea leaf, all kinds of interesting greens in it to create a color maybe for the fall. Yeah, very, very cute. I like this. And very local as you said. If you look really closely, very pretty colors. Thank you. And then the bigger arrangement that you brought here on the vase. This is a very simple arrangement that you could use also for a wedding, maybe, mm -hmm. or centerpiece. It gives you a lot of height, mm -hmm. very, but doesn't take so much space on your table. And you can also see through because it's always glass. Right. It's just greens, local green song of India, and maybe a few anthems that I brought in for color. And again, this is just the vase, so if yeah. this is too tall for you, you, you can just, just easily it remove it. And it becomes another table. A centerpiece. Yeah. Perfect. And mm -hmm. then it's something we're all familiar with right here. An orchid plant. Yes. A plant is always nice for any party, mm -hmm. for a head table, side table, just something simple. Okay. Again, important not just to support local for the economy, but also mm -hmm. to cut down on invasive species. Correct. All right. And if you need more information, just head over to our website, khon2.com. Thank you for being here. Thank you.